It is commencement night at Oceaneering, Inc., which performs complex overhauls, repairs, and modernizations for U.S. Navy submarines. But these graduates are not receiving college degrees. Instead, they have earned valuable certificates in ship fitting and welding, industrial engineering, and machining. Ever since I was little, I've just been doing, always tinkering with things, using tools, and I can get paid for it every day and get paid for school, so. Not bad. Not bad. You put a challenge in front of him, and he will try to make it all the way through. Janet Treadwell always had faith in her son, Mike, a newly minted inside machinist who, like his fellow apprentices, worked during the day and went to school at night for four years. I didn't have to kick him in the butt. He, <laughs> he, did, it, he did it all himself, all that fits. And I couldn't be prouder of him. I was there to see him do all the work. I helped him write his papers. I helped him do his research. <laughs> it was wonderful. Yes, getting Mike through his training was a family affair, but it paid off. I bought a home during that time. Um, went through about four different vehicles as well, but we made it. I was working on a fishing boat. And? That was it. Not really. I was trying to go to TCC, but I didn't know what I wanted to do. And then Matthew Bragg learned about the apprenticeship, which fit his interests to a T. He's got, always had this mechanical ability. Go get Matthew to fix it. So this program helped find him focus, and here we are. I can't be, I'm more proud of him right now than any kid that's graduating from college the regular way. A lot of sacrifices, a lot of late nights. Yeah. Samantha Height endured the rigorous apprenticeship process right along with her husband. It's opened up doors that I never thought could be possible, you know. For someone who's not a veteran and someone who doesn't know about ship systems and stuff like that, it allows you to come in at entry level and learn things from the bottom up. My first job was working at U-Haul. After leaving the Navy to spend more time with his family, Nathaniel Dunlap went through several low-wage jobs. I said, man, I need a more consistent you know, steady paying job. Then he heard about an opportunity at Oceaneering. And I said, you know what? If I join the apprenticeship, I can learn a trade and I can make more money within those four years. And for plenty more after that, to his wife's delight. I'm looking forward to us to, for us to come. Yes, these grads made the smart choice.